Hi, I'm Todd Llewellyn and I work for Clearwire and I'm going to be showing you the Clearwire drive demo today. Let's start by doing a speed test. What we're doing here is we're actually going out and measuring the speed on downlink and on uplink. As you can see, we just got 7.957 megabits of downlink speed and we're getting 3.9 megabits of uplink speed. Again, while driving down the road in a car. And we now just uh, clicked on XM Radio and we're actually uh, live streaming music. As you can hear, we're getting you know, very good quality, very good sound. And this is again streaming right off the internet over a WiMAX connection. Another interesting example of what you can do with this network. Here, when we go out to Flickr, We've taken photos throughout the day and those photos have been uploaded within seconds, have uploaded up to the Flickr site. Again, great example of what you can do with a broadband connection that's truly mobile. So here we're pulling up CNN and we're actually streaming live off of CNN's site. We're getting very good video quality. We're able to watch CNN uh, streaming live from their site. This is what you would see if you were at, uh, at home watching it on your television. Now let's go look at a really interesting use case. I'm going to go double click on this icon and we're going out and we're accessing a set-top box of one of our employees in Seattle, Washington and it's playing the Disney Channel off of that set-top box in that individual's living room while we're driving down the road. Another great capability that our WiMAX multi-megabit mobile network provides is the ability to do location-based services. We're going to pull up a Google application and what we're showing here is a Google map. And the green marker is representing where we're at on the map. It's tracking us as we go down the road. Here as an example, we can pull up points of interest. In this case, we're looking at restaurants in the area next to us. I can go and click on the Renaissance Hotel and it goes directly to a VoIP call over WiMAX. I'm now calling the Renaissance Hotel. Thank you for calling Renaissance Las Vegas. This is Christy. Um, yeah, hi Christy. Do you have any availability for uh, rooms this evening? I am so sorry. We are completely sold out this evening. We're fully committed. Okay, no problem. Understood. Thanks. Good luck to you. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. So, great call, great sound quality. Uh, you can see the ability to integrate VoIP calling in with a location-based service. Imagine as well the advertising opportunities uh, as you're driving down the road, being able to see movies that are available in a theater down the road if you wanted to go to a theater, uh, being able to see th things that are on sale at certain stores and shops that are in your vicinity, it really opens up an array of location-based services and advertising uh, with this kind of a broadband connection that's truly mobile. When we talk about front seat navigation, another really interesting capability is traffic. We're going to go out to a local news, news station in Portland, Oregon. I'm able to go pull up live feeds of traffic cameras. And in Portland, what they do is about every 10 to 15 seconds, they rotate cameras and show you a new view. And you can see it just did that. It switched to a different camera. And you can see the traffic. So if I'm going to work, I have now have the ability to look at live feeds and see where is their congestion, where is the traffic flowing, make my navigation decisions as I drive into work. It'll be interesting to see how many more uh, live cameras go up over time when you have users with the ability to actually access them while they're on the go, not just from at home.